Welcome back. We've got a red event over here at the Sunflower Inn, but let's go see what's going on at the Fountain Plaza first. It's Fury Info from Lola. Yo. Lola, how's it going? Yikes, you look really down. What's going on? <sighs> uh, hey, handsome. Well, I got this intel, but it's weak and I don't know if it'll sell. If I give you a deal, will you take it? Yep. Of course I will. <laughs> Thanks, handsome. I love you. Mostly your money, though. There's one in the Zawaza Plains. Get him. All right, then. Dum, dum, dum. Young man, such a beautiful person. Hey, you. Can I ask you something? So, my son signed up for a charity drive for the local orphanage. We went. I saw a beautiful woman, a Dorfer exec, and I talked to her for hours. My wife found out, though, and now she isn't cooking for me. Whoa, no cooking at all. That's rough, buddy, but hey, that's what you get for barking up the wrong tree. Apologize to your wife, bro. Yeah, too right, Fang, too right. Boy! H hey, um... What is it, lad? Why are you holding your hand out to me? Could it be that you're hungry? You're some kind of character, right? My mum said I should get your autograph or see if you're giving out candy or something. So ah, completely logical approach. That was it. Okay. Fine. Red event. その宿敵の隣人こそが我が輩が教員の時の教えを持つ父親であり板前時代の伏線を意外な形で回収したわけであるそう答えは全て車輪の中に最初から仕込まれていたというわけよそれで事件は解決に向かうと思った矢先海の
名機へと作り変えていったのを始め。But why did he go to Dorfa? Did he need their money, their resources? Why? バーナードや花形と結託し、見たこともないような装置を開発していった。リンネの兄を妖精へと変えた、人造妖精開発装置などな。やつらは手段を選んでいない。少しでも適合率の高そうな被験者がいれば、それが年はもいかぬ子供だとしても、本人が望む望まない関係なく実験を行っている。ゲドーみてえな商業だな。毎日目まぐるしいスピードで、ドルファの技術は向上していった。花形もバーナードもそれを喜んでいたが。あんなのは異常だアポローネスさんその男の顔は見ましたかいやいつもフードをかぶっていて顔は確認できなかった正体はつかめずですね正体か強いて言うならアルレルト並みの知識を持った男だなそのレトルトなんちゃらって名前なんか前にも聞いたな古代に実在したと言われている天才科学者ですよ知恵の回廊や逆さまの円筒天への木ざ橋もともと天へ伸びる巨大なエレベーターだったといいますそれらの完成は彼の功績あってのことだと伝わっていますね人を空へより広いところへより豊かな暮らしへと押し上げたいそのような考えを持っていたそうですああ思い出してきたぞ確か絵本にもなっていたよなあれでも本の中では悪人だったような兵器かなんかを作って世界を滅ぼしかけたんじゃなかったかいや、yeah, that could be very worrying then 女神と邪神の戦いのさなか彼は女神に力を貸そうと己の兵器で邪神を攻撃したのですその効果は凄まじくさすがに邪神もただでは済まなかったようです I mean it would have to be quite a big weapon quite a powerful weapon if the vile god felt the effects just wow I mean it's a god so ただし兵器は邪神を傷つけただけでなく車線上にあった都市をも消滅させてしまいましたけれどうわ最悪彼が行ったことは決して許されることではありませんですが女神の力となり人々を救いたいと願った気持ちは本物だったのかもしれませんよもしそうならば彼を悪人と断ずるのも早計かもしれませんね And if such a person is now working for Dorfa, though. Uh oh. Huh. Kawatana Sharma. Mukashi wa aqua soku kiristel, that tan ya. Oh. So come s h i r e m a s e Tony Kaku. Moktekiwa wakarimasenga. Arrel to Nami no Zuno o Motta Jimbusga. Dorfa de Anyak Stale to you koto des. でもなんつうか新しい情報が分かったって感じでもねえなならばドルファの計画について話そうやつらは邪神をよみがえらせようとしている well, that much we already knew, so... 知ってるなんとなくみんなで予想してた yeah, that, that's basic information there, mate. まあほらヒューリーを集めてるわけだからね簡単に予想できるというかならばこれならどうだドルファは人造フェンサーを量産して軍備強化を図っている I mean more recent information yeah but again we, we already know that so それも逆算すれば簡単に予想できますねアポローネスなんかかわいそう
めっぽくないじゃあお開きでいい加減話をするのも聞くのも飽きてきたぜそろそろロロのところに顔でも見せっかなんか新しい情報が入ってるかもしれねえし I mean she did the last time we saw her どうしたシャルマ昔の僕ならアポローネスさんが降伏した時に殺していた Fang has definitely had an impact on you でも今はこうして仲間として迎え共にドルファと戦う同志になっている大きな変化だなああ覚悟が変わったんだと思う殺す覚悟ではなく共に歩もうとする覚悟を決めるように僕のこの変化はいい変化なんだろうか Seems good to me. 少なくとも現時点においてはプラスの方向に働いていると判断する I like your Ryushin's qualifier there at this moment because yeah it, it, it could be something that could be a negative just depends where it goes but right now yeah a positive one so at the moment He's growing. 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 He's Just, just from a simple idea of where could the game series go rather than having the original, then the sort of extended remake, and then this, which is a different story in the same time period. What they could do is have a story in another nation. We don't need to follow Fang and the rest. We, we don't need to do that. We can hear about them. Passively, but we、we'll、just follow a different group of fences doing a different thing in another nation somewhere in another city. There's things you can do there, there's things you could do. I mean, think of it this way there's no reason you couldn't have had this story as a not a sequel, is it what, what is it like a side call, like a story that's happening elsewhere at the same time. In another nation, you could have like a group of fences and they meet someone who has the power of song. You could have this story separate to everything else, still be in the fairy fencer world, just again separate. So, I, I, there's got to be a reason why they decided to go with Fang's group over that idea. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe just because they're fan favorites? It's probably that, but there's loads of other ideas you could do with this world. Especially because we were left hanging after、um, Advent Dark Force. It's sort of like a where does the story go now kind of feeling to the true ending of that game. Hopefully, one day we find out. Anyway. Hi, Hanagata Shacho. だがこうなってくると我が社の今後の方針をどうするか再考が必要かもしれんな当初の計画通り各地に散らばるフューリーを集め邪神を復活させ世界を支配する力をドルファが得るしかし世界を牛耳る力ならば邪神の力を借りずともすでに我らの支柱にあるではないかドルファはすでにヒューリーもフェンサーも妖精もこの手で作り出せるのだ確かにそうかもしれませんですがどの道も捨てずに進めるのが良作かとセンシブルフロムバナーダ今のドルファには予算も人材も惜しむ必要などないのですから<笑>確かにそうだなでは今後もバーナード
お前に任せるぞはっ<笑>資料の浅い男だドルファは力など持っていない人造フェンサー開発装置などにしても肝心なところは全てあの方に握られているではないかブラックボックスを解明できない限り手綱はあの方に握られたまま And I assume that's not something you like, Bernard. もしあの方がサリでもしたら、我らに装置を制御することは不可能だ。だからこそ、邪神の復活も並行して進めねばならん。ドルファなど、どうでもいい。だが、邪神にせよ、装置にせよ、なんとかしてその力を、この支柱に収めねば。今は目の前の問題を片付けていくとしよう。焦ることはない。木は必ずやってくる。マリアノカ、入れ。要件は We haven't seen you in a while. Pretty much the start of the game when we first met. Glace, really. アポローネスが裏切った。追って殺せ。ポローネスがしかし殺す必要があるのですか彼が持っている情報なんてたかが知れているでしょうに。Nothing we don't already know, apparently. 私も同様、肝心なことは何も知らされていませんが。殺せ。ドルファを。私を裏切った者に命はない。お前もよく覚えておくのだな。かしこまりました。Oh? <laughs> That's a point. We haven't seen him since the noise situation. Huh. Pai ga wa o b アポローネスまさかあなたがドルファを去るなんて<笑>正直に言えば私も今のドルファにいい感情は抱いてないむしろ恐怖を感じることもあるそれでもあの子たちのためなら私は地獄に落ちても構わないわ、ね Okay, so what's going on here? Quite a few things here, but I feel like we'll have a look at the fountain with the red exclamation. It's probably Lola. Oh, Lola! Told you! My dear, I need you! Kyo, what do you think of the show? I'm going to go to the show. 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 Wait, why would. Why would you want a self destructing rice cooker? Why? Wait, all of them do? Wait, 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 hold on. Knife and cutting board? Seems fine to me. All in one seafood grill? Seems fine. It's the self destructing rice cooker that gets me. What? Why? Again, how? Especially in the middle one. How is a knife and cutting board bad? I don't know. Why would you call it junk? It's a cutting board and you've got a knife for it. Unless it's an all in one thing, it's a knife and cutting board. So it's, it's a knife cutting board. I don't know! Someone help! Oh, there we go. Oh, 
古いみたいだからああまだふてくされてるのねどうせ言っても無駄だと思うよドルファのフェンサーに先越されてるよ Yeah, there's not much we can do there. 先を越されるのは別にロロのせいじゃないだろうだからそんなふてくされになってお客さんがみんなお兄ちゃんくらい理解のある人ならいいんだけどさ行くの I mean we may as well go have a look あ,あ無駄足かもしれんがそれでもいい他に情報もねえしな、yeah. It's worth a check. So, I'm going to get it. Dolph and the face are going to be able to get it. I'm going 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 to get it. At this point in time, they're just. Nothing to us. No.、Oh. Wait, when did that one pop up? Oh, yes. That's when I was, I was very confused. I couldn't remember picking up another quest anywhere. But yeah, I, I did get one from Lola, didn't I? Right, so let's see. Oh my. Got a quite, quite a few more as a result of that. Several of Apollonius. All right, let's have a look at Marissa. Have you already forgotten? Yes. N not, I'm not answering the question. Or am I? Maybe I did forget. <laughs> What a lovely cup of tea. Oh, delightful. Tea time in the evening. It can be done. It can be done. So, yes. Care to join me? Why, thank you, but it's almost time for my bath.、Mm -hmm. One cup should be fine, right? I suppose you're right. Well, then, if you insist. Where is Pippin, by the way? <laughs> He's outside with Apollonius, drooling away with swords. Quite ambitious to be practicing so late. I believe it reminds him of when he was young. He certainly seems to enjoy it. <laughs> Pippin and Apollonius seem to be kindred spirits. It's nice to see them get along so well. <laughs> yes, indeed. Pippin's joy is my joy. <laughs> Speaking of which, Marissa. Where is Galdo?、Mm. He's probably off with Fang, looking at some nudie magazine. <sighs> he says he feels uncomfortable looking at those magazines when I'm around. Would you say that's normal?、Mm. Yes, I believe most young men would feel that way. Not that I know much about it.、Mm? Ah, that's right. You said before that you're not interested in the female form, didn't you? <laughs> yes, that's correct. Well, that's not so rare, I suppose. Oh, there you are, Soji. Come on, it's time for our bath. Indeed. I was about to call for you myself.、Mm? Oh, you two are going to the bath together? We sure are. And there's a new bath house that's just opened round the corner. And we get a discount if we go together. Oh, Marissa, why don't you take your goldikins there? It's rare to see you with a frown. Do you have some kind of issue with going to a bathhouse with Galdo? <sighs> Not exactly, but. <laughs> but? <sighs> We used to go to a bathhouse in the next town over. We'd bring along our soap, a bottle of shampoo, everything. <sighs> but you know, the women and men's baths are separated, right? So before we went in, we promised each other we'd leave together. I don't know why, but Goldikins always took longer in the bath than me, and I ended up waiting for him.、More? Then he'd come out and touch me on my cooled off shoulder and say, Ha,、ah, you're gold. <sighs> Thinking back on it makes me feel so sad. For some reason, hearing you talk about the bathhouse just reminded me of that time. So hey, Soji, I don't know why, but. I just had this sad old song pop into my head. So yes. And I pictured a small one room house with a river running outside the window.、Eh? How did you know that? Back when we had no money, we lived in a house just like that. 
with a river running by it. So Seriously. Hang on. Have you told that story to anyone but us? Mm -hmm. Let's see. Yes, some time ago. I may have told it to a man with shaggy hair, glasses, and a guitar. So this That's it. No doubt. <sighs> yeah, for sure. And no idea the lyrics came from somewhere so close to home. Marisa. I heard there's a new bathhouse that's just opened up. Wanna go for old time's sake? <laughs> I can change clothes all by myself now. I won't make you wait like last time. And Wait, that was the reason? So, ne well, if you say so, Godlykins. It has been a while since we've gone to one together. So, da, In that case, let's invite everyone. The more the merrier, am I right? You, sir. I'll go get Fang and the other boys. I'll go tell Pippin and the others. And I'll get the ladies. We don't want you to be left alone waiting again, do we? Ah. Oh my! <laughs> this is already a memory in the making. Indeed. Alright then. Oh! The secrets of the world. Yes. Hey. Who's that over there? Ha. Oi. You're not committing to the attack. Ta. Mm. Yes, good, like that. Ano. You two seem to be really going at it. Doing some hand to hand sparring. Pardon. I'd call it training more than anything else. Rin said she wanted some pointers. Apollonius is a surprisingly good teacher. He's polite and his directions are easy to understand. <laughs> oh, that is surprising. Oi. Surely it's not that surprising. Hey. Still though, hmm, I see. Okay. What? What are you staring at? Ano... Do you ever think that axe might be a bit too heavy for you, Ren? Oh. No. So that, eh? No, I suppose not. And you, Apollonius. Do you ever find that sword to be unwieldy? Ina. Never. I see. I should have expected as much. Sorry, it's just interesting to see your weapons in action like this. Oi. What's interesting about it? Hey. A fury is only useful if it's well matched with its user. But that usually indicates the fencer's compatibility with their fairy. Hey. Put another way, the weapon itself is not all that important. Interesting, yes? So when you put it that way. Ano... Your sword is so large it's hard to imagine anyone but you wielding it. And Rin, at a glance, that axe looks far too big for you. So this eh? leads me to concede that physical strength is not a factor that contributes to fury compatibility. Yeah. Come to think of it, I've never heard of a fencer having trouble wielding their weapon. It's just as you both say, no trouble at all. To sum it up, perhaps the weapon is somehow capable of telling the wielders how best to use them. But then, what is doing the telling? Fairies? Furies themselves? The plot thickens. A fascinating mystery. Indeed. Hmm, now that you mention it, I've never thought about it before. What about you? As a fairy, do you have any recollection of telling Fleur or anything like that? <laughs> Not especially, no. No, my situation with Fleur is a little exceptional. So that's inconclusive. No. But you're a fairy. How could you not know? <laughs> well, to put it another way, I'm not exactly sure what I am. I suppose it's hardest to see what's directly under your nose. <laughs> Perhaps I must study myself, yes. That would be one approach. By doing so, then perhaps... Hmm... How very interesting. <laughs> He's mumbling to himself again. Scientists sure are weird. Oh no, what's the word? Eccentric. 
And again, their whole job is to study things that ordinary people don't even think of. So maybe they should be weird. I thought the word was eccentric. You're back to calling them weird already? <laughs> Fantastic, wonderful. Will wonders truly never cease? Yeah, weird's the right word. Oh dear. Alright, so we'll use that as a place to end this part here then. And in the next part, we shall see about getting these done. So we got that one, that one, and three there with Apollonius. So, one of these is probably going to be leading to a mission somewhere, I imagine. But we'll see about that in the next part. Ta-da! For now!